Britpop phenomenon. Brett Anderson's band Suede were dubbed in 1992 by the British press as the greatest band in Britain. And that was before they even released their first ever single. Music pundits credit Suede with founding the Britpop movement, but they've been silent for the past two years, letting the youngsters get on with it. They bounce back with Coming Up. we started off in the very early days has been copied in essence by all of these bands that have called themselves Britpop bands. Coming British filmmakers. Suede fans are loyal, so it was no surprise to find London's Virgin Megastore packed to the rafters at midnight when the band laid on a special concert to launch their latest album, Coming Up. It ended a three-year recording silence and is the first to feature new guitarist Richard Oakes, who replaced Bernard Butler in 1994. Do they feel, though, they've been left behind by Britpop? Yeah, I hope so. I think we're all, we've always been swimming against time. I think we always will. I think it's what makes the music, it gives it its edge. I don't think there's anyone that makes the sort of music we do, you know. It's partly a sense of, a lack of a sense of place, you know, we don't really have a place. I like it. We've never been one of the gang, you know, these gangs, they come and go. Like the death of the gang means the death of the members of the gang, and why he's never been a member of a gang, that's why we'll carry on. The band's latest single, Trash, sold well in the UK and prepared the way for the album. It remains to be seen if they've missed the Britpop boat or not. When Suede hit the big time four years ago, they were hailed as the saviours of English pop. But as the hype died down, along with the record sales, the sudden departure of guitarist Bernard Butler left the rest of the group in musical limbo. Now leads.